One of the hardest aspects of glass blowing is, is learning how to manipulate that, that material. Glass blowing literally is nothing more than the manipulation of heat. It always takes a, uh, an artisan uh, to, you know, a few years to learn how to manage that heat and how to uh, form those vessels or their sculptural pieces in such a way where you're following the lead of the material and you're working one-on-one -on -one with, that, with that molten, molten magma. Once you realize how to manage that heat, then, then you're able to, uh, oh, I guess, manage your vision uh, you know, more productively. The most rewarding aspect about glass to me is, is starting off with uh, a vision or a sketch or, or, or some sort of you know, uh, image that I have in my mind and, and actually working through, you know, testing, trying to go through how, to, how that material is going to uh, actually be manipulated to uh, achieve that particular shape or form. You know, just uh, seeing that sketch come to life uh, is uh, probably the most rewarding.